playoffs are here, which is this time of year is great for Shea Z soccer. It's their favorite time of year. It means the true beginning of a run for another state title. The two-time defending state champs are more than ready to add to their trophy case, but can't do it without a win each and every time out now. The defending two-time state champ, Shea Z at home with Minerva Newcomb this afternoon in early going. Cape Winter playing for the opposing team. Gets a nice save, keeps Shea Z off the board. He would later get some help. Well, from a post, off the set piece, coming in from the right side. There it is, Boink coming right back out, put right back in, and then his defender helps him out, but with his hand, that's a no-no. The refs give Shea Z a penalty kick. Josh Barrier and Schurz, the Eagles, come away with a lead on the possession, 1-0. 38 seconds later, the initial shot, sure, that's going to be stopped, but Kyle Drake isn't. Punching it home, 2-0 lead. Then after that, Winter makes another big stop, but... Connor Morris waiting on the doorstep, able to get right in, punch it home. 3 nothing Eagles. They get a lucky seven goals in this one in advance to Saturday's Class B championship this weekend. Out to the campus of UVM for the D2 field hockey semifinals. Top seeded Rice taking on Harwood. Both teams have been to the championship game the last couple of years. Second half, Luke and Stillman carries down the far side, centering pass to Megan Collins, who finds the board for a 2 nothing lead. The Highlanders simply could not answer the Rice goaltender. Jacqueline Bartlett. She slaps away the ball to deny the goal for offense, but then adds some on the other side. The insurance. Minutes later, some tic tac toe passing from the Green Knight Stillman. Feeds Michelle Bolger for the one timer. 3 0 Rice. Minutes later, Sierra Combs is in on the break. Throws the exclamation point on this one. Rice advances to the state championship. They will face U32 on Saturday at UVM. Rice was in the title game last year. They lost, so of course, they're going back for some revenge.